Good afternoon, everyone, and happy Thursday. I'm back again with my second story time for today. Uh, this one is a very special um, story time. I see um, a lot of people on Facebook are celebrating um, virtual proms and they're celebrating virtual graduations um, for the class of 2020 during these difficult times. And, you know, I figured why not spread a message to these youngsters or young adults who will be graduating this year and feels like, um, you know, they don't have the advantage like most of us had to go to prom or to have an actual graduation or to even have a party to celebrate it due to social distancing and of course the pandemic. So I figured, you know, why not do a little tribute to them and read a story that was actually given to me as a book um, for my high school graduation. And I hope that this message gets clear, whether they're graduating from, you know, middle school, high school, college, grad school, law school, any type of school, nursing schools, uh, just so you can stay encouraged and stay positive and, you know, keep the faith because we will see better days. Uh, and just stay strong and stay focused. Don't give up. Oh, and also, <laughs> I am wearing my uh, Montclair State University graduation cap from 2008. I uh, know it's been a long time, I'm old, but it's all good. I figured instead of doing a cosplay, I'll do something a little bit more symbolic to when I'm reading and what this story time is all about. All right, so let me let you hear this message, young guys out there, or young girls. <laughs> Stay strong, don't give up. All oh, the places you'll go. Originally published in 1990. Of course, this is from the shoes. Congratulations! Today is your day. You're off to great places. You're off and away. You have brains in your head. You have feet in your shoes. You can steer yourself any direction you choose. You're on your own and you know what you know and you are the guy who'll decide where to go. Guy or girl. So if you hear guy, this means, you know, universal, guy or girl. So. <laughs> You'll look up and down streets. Look them over with care. About some will say, I don't choose to go there. With your head full of brains and your shoes full of feet, you're too smart to go down any not so good street. And you will, and you may not find any you'll want to go down. In that case, of course, you'll head straight out of town. It's opener there and a wide open air. I almost just dropped the book. <laughs> Anyways, moving on. <laughs> Out there, things can happen and frequently do to people as brainy and footsy as you. And when things start to happen, don't worry, don't stew. Just go right along. You'll start happening too. All oh, the places you'll go. You'll be on your way up. You'll be seeing great sights. You'll join the high flyers who soar to high heights. You won't lag behind because you'll have the speed. You'll pass the whole gang and you'll soon take the lead. Wherever you fly, you'll be just the best of the best. Wherever you go, you will top all the rest. Except when you don't, because sometimes you won't. I'm sorry to say so, but sadly it's true. The bang-ups, the hang-ups can happen to you. You can get all hung up 
and a prickly perch and your gang will fly on, you'll be left in the lurch. You'll come down from the lurch with an unpleasant bump. The chances are then you'll be in a slump. And when you're in a slump, you'll not in much, you'll not in much fun on slumping yourself is not easily done. We'll get in that slump. <laughs> okay. You will come to a place where the streets are not marked. Some windows are lighted, but mostly they're dark. A place you could spin, you could sprain both your elbow and chin. Do you dare to stay out? Do you dare to go in? How much can you lose? How much can you win? And if you go in, should you turn left or right, or right in three quarters, or maybe not quite, or go around back and sneak in from behind, simply is not, I'm afraid you will find, for a mind maker up, upper to make up his mind. You can get so confused, then you'll start in a race, down long wiggle roads, at the breaknecking pace and the grind on a miles across weirdish wild space headed I fear to a most useless place the waiting place for people just waiting waiting for a train to go or a bus to come or a plane to go or the mail to come or the rain to go, or the phone to ring, or the snow to snow, or waiting around for a yes or a no, or waiting for their hair to grow. Everyone is just waiting. Waiting for the fish to bite, waiting for the wind to fly a kite, or waiting around for Friday night, or waiting perhaps for their Uncle Jake, or a pot to boil, or a butter break, or a better break, <laughs> or strings of pearls, or a pair of pants, or a wig with curls, or another chance. Everyone is just waiting. No, that's not for you. Somehow, you'll escape. And that waiting and staying, you'll find the bright places where the boom bands are playing. With banner flip-flapping, once more you'll ride high, ready for anything under the sky, ready because you're the great, you're that kind of guy. All the places you'll go, there is fun to be done. There are points to be scored, there are games to be won. And the magical things you can do with that ball will make you the winningest winner of all. Fame. You'll be famous as famous can be with the whole wide world watching you win on TV. <laughs> Except when they don't, because sometimes they won't, I'm afraid that some things and sometimes you'll play lonely games too. Games you can't win because you'll play against you. All alone, whether you like it or not, alone will be something you'll be quite a lot. And when you're alone, there's a very good chance you'll meet the things that scare you right out of your pants. <laughs> there are some down the road between Hither and yon, that can scare you so much, you won't want to go on. But on you will go, though the weather be foul. On you will go, though your enemies prowl. On you will go, through the hank and cracks howl. Onward up many of the frightening creeks, though your arms may get sore and your sneakers may leak, 
on and on you will hike and know you will hike far and face up to your problems, whatever they are. Stay strong, guys. <laughs> You'll get mixed up, of course, as you already know. You'll get mixed up with many strange birds as you go. So be sure when you step, step with care and great tact. And remember that life's a great balancing act. Just never forget to be dexterous and deaf. And never mix up your right foot with your left. And you will succeed. Yes, you will indeed. 98 and three quarter percent guaranteed. Kid, you'll move mountains. So, be your name, Buxbun, or Bixby, or Bray, or Mordecai, Ali, Van, Allen, O'Shea, you're off to great places. Today is your day. Your mountain is waiting, so get on your way. The end. <laughs> oh, the places you'll go. I actually like that story. It, it kind of gets a little trippy, <laughs> but it's just letting you know that you will run into, you know, difficulties, times when you want to give up, times when you feel like you're losing faith, but just stay strong, steadfast, keep moving, stay focused, and you'll get through it. And just like these times, um, stay strong, stay positive. You know, you, you guys are our future, so... You know, we have to start now. We need to start with the leaderships now. And just stay strong. We'll get through this. And to those who are graduating this year, congratulations. You have done it. You've made it through. Whether you finish in May or whether you finish in June, you've made it through. And I'm definitely, definitely proud of you. And I did I just made that, you know, rhyme, <laughs> but it's truthful from my heart. And <sighs> congratulations, hats off to the class of 2020. Thank you guys for tuning in. Love you all. Stay positive, stay strong. And remember, bad times don't last long. Bye.